Well, my father told me years ago when I first got into the National Football League, son, keep everything that you have because you never know where your place in history would be. 2002, I had a very unique opportunity to become the all-time leader in Russia. And so what I did, I took the initiative to put smart tags into my uniforms. I bought 20 different jerseys, four or five different helmets. That's what we're doing over here at Provo is preserving value and giving consumers an opportunity to research the items that we are archiving and tagging at the beginning of the process, throughout the process, and tracking some of the process through our apps to make sure that the consumers are getting what they really want to pay for. Our process is we tag things at the manufacturing plant, or we tag things before it's even issued to a player. I can get over here on this side here and scan this helmet up here and bring it down, and you can see that the helmet is, itself is authentic. I can do all my research to try to figure out the date that it was signed, and so now, I can choose to pay $450 for it if I want to. Years ago, probably in 98, I uh, found myself in Sherman Oaks Mall. We walked by this sports memorabilia collectible shop and I see my mini helmet. And I'm looking at the signature and I'm like saying to myself, that is not my signature. Retail product it is a heavily fraudulent market. We're talking about estimating about $1.7 billion of fraudulent activity in 2015. And that's how I got into the business.